Flufenazine, Wikipedia Audio Flufenazine, sold under the brand names Prolixin among others, is an antipsychotic medication. It is used in the treatment of chronic psychoses such as schizophrenia, and appears to be about equal in effectiveness to low-potency antipsychotics like chlorpromazine. It is given by mouth, injection into a muscle, or just under the skin. There is also a long-acting injectable version that may last for up to four weeks. Flufenazine decanoate, the depot injection form of flufenazine, should not be used by people with severe depression. Common side effects include movement problems, sleepiness, depression, and increased weight. Serious side effects may include neuroleptic malignant syndrome, low white blood cell levels, and the potentially permanent movement disorder tardive dyskinesia. In older people with psychosis as a result of dementia it may increase the risk of dying. It may also increase prolactin levels which may result in milk production, enlarged breasts in males, impotence, and the absence of menstrual periods. It is unclear if it is safe for use in pregnancy. Flufenazine is a typical antipsychotic of the phenothiazine class. Its mechanism of action is not entirely clear but believed to be related to its ability to block dopamine receptors. In up to 40% of those on long-term phenothiazines, liver function tests become mildly abnormal. Flufenazine came into use in 1959. The injectable form is on the World Health Organization's list of essential medicines, the most effective and safe medicines needed in a health system. It is available as a generic medication. In the United States the tablets costs between 0.22 and 42 cents per day for a typical dose. The wholesale cost in the developing world of the long-acting form is between 0.20 and 6 US dollars and 20 cents per injection as of 2014. It was discontinued in Australia around mid-2017. Other Animals In horses, it is sometimes given by injection as an anxiety-relieving medication, though there are many negative common side effects and it is forbidden by many equestrian competition organizations.